In this video, I'm going to show you how to do a beer cap frame. What you're going to need is a picture frame any size you want, beer bottle caps, a hot glue gun, and a piece of scrap of paper. The first thing you're going to do is you're going to want to take everything out that the picture frame came with, including the glass. But what I do is I just flip it inside out type of thing where I put everything in backwards. So I put the glass, the paper, and the scrap of paper that I want actually in the front just in case later on you actually want to use the picture frame for actual pictures. Now you want to go ahead and grab your beer bottle caps. Um, I collected these from friends and family, but you can also maybe go to a restaurant and ask and see if they'll save them for you for you know the afternoon or for whenever you're there. What you want to do is you want to start lining them up to see how many fit across. The picture frame that I chose, I can't fit just straight beer bottle caps, so I had to kind of make it where I had a little bit of space between the frame and the actual caps. And I usually like to line them up and make sure like what exactly the shape of it is that I'm going to use. Um, I ended up having six across and eight down. And that way you know when you start gluing, you don't make a mistake. Now that you've figured out how you're going to arrange your beer bottle caps, you want to start gluing them. Um, it depends on what you're using to glue. I'm using hot glue, so I'm using it around the rim. The first try, I did it like I piled on the hot glue in the middle of the cap to try to make it stick. But obviously that's a lot of a lot of glue. You're wasting a lot. So I find that if you put it right around the rim, it stays on perfect. There's not, usually if you're pretty you know good about it, there's not any glue coming out from underneath the cap. While you're gluing, you also want to make sure that you're trying to be as straight as possible if you're leaving spaces like I am. If you're going all the way across and there's no paper being seen, then obviously, you know, the picture frame will help you stay straight. I got a variety of caps just because I got them from multiple people. So, you know, everyone drinks different kinds of beer. You can also do this with soda caps, like Pe Pepsi or Coca-Cola when they come in the glass jars. They usually come with these caps. You can use that too. You actually can even use the ones in the plastic bottles, the different kinds of Cokes. That would be a really cool one too. You can obviously use the same beer bottle caps if the person you're making this for really only drinks one kind of beer or they only prefer one kind of beer. Then you can, oh, you know, if they like Heineken, you can use all Heineken. If they like Coronas, you can use all Coronas, Bud Light, you know, you know so on and so forth. And if you're doing it for somebody with, um, with a Coke, like Pepsi products or Coke products, then obviously, you know, you use all the same ones. The only problem is that if you're going to use the plastic caps that come in the plastic beer bottles, they're not going to be magnetized. So the only way I see you doing this is adding an extra step and putting a small piece of magnet inside of each cap. And then that's the only way. But that obviously would take a long time depending on the size of the picture frame you're using. The rest of the DIY is pretty basic. You just keep filling in the frame with the beer bottle caps. And depending on the size of your frame depends on how many you're going to need and how much time it's going to take you. But if you guys try this out, go ahead and tag me on Instagram or Twitter. And thanks so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, rate, and comment.